In this example too, we see the difference between straight line depreciation and reducing balance depreciation. In, we see in both examples the present stock is 1,000 litres. Let's look at estimate A. This is straight line depreciation. So what would the stock be in 20 days? This is the, the final answer. Well, it would be 100,000, what it is at the moment, minus 4,000 every 20 days, so 4,000 by 20. So this is 100,000 minus 80,000, which is 20,000 litre. Estimate D is using reducing balance depreciation. This uses the formula that the future value is equal to P1 minus I to the power of T. Well, I is 5%, so 1 minus I is 0.95, or 95%. So the future value is 100,000 by 0.95 to the power of 20. And this is 35,849 litres. And so these are how they compare. We see that we are doesn't reduce as much with the reducing balance. And what's the difference between the two answers? Well, that would be 30, 35,849 minus 20,000. The difference here we see is 15,849 litres. And that's an important example.